league is set to kick off on 12 April 2008. Games will be played in April, May, and June. We'll have a playoff, and the uh, championship game will be on July the 3rd. All players must have completed their four years of eligibility and graduated and earned their degree. Uh, the league is trying to put a positive influence on uh, Miles Brand issue in the NCAA with regards to graduation rates, and uh, we've already seen players in our super combo tryouts that we've had across the country. They are going back to college to get their degree so they can play in the league. There's going to be six teams, Florida, Alabama, Arkansas, Tennessee, Texas, and Michigan. Florida will play their games, will play three games in the Swamp and one in Tampa. Alabama will play in Legion Field, Arkansas War Memorial, Tennessee in Neyland Stadium. Rice will play at Rice Stadium for the Texas team, and Michigan will play at Ford Field. Now, the All-American Football League is a spring season, college-style professional football league, and we're going to utilize college football players from each particular area, universities, and the surrounding areas to compete against other state teams. And the league does not compete against the NFL, does not complete, compete against the high school football, and we do not compete against uh, college football. It will be played in the spring, and it will always be in the spring. Now, all the teams are located in great football areas, as you well know, and uh, where, where fall and spring football is king, football is a passion, and football fans are rabid. We've done extensive major research in all of these areas and all the stadiums are sold out and the demand for football continues to exist in the particular area. There are local families in those areas that are growing up with their children that have never seen a college football game other than on television. And now they have the opportunity as an example in Alabama to see Alabama Stars, Auburn Stars, Troy Stars come together on a team to play uh, Arkansas, Tennessee, Texas and what have you. Uh, ticket prices are going to be affordable, $13. They start at $13 and go to $53 for a 50-yard line seat. Uh, the universities are going to benefit financially because we're going to we're going to give them rental fees. They keep the concessions. They pay. Uh, they keep the parking, and uh, this will assist their budgets plus the utilization of the stadiums in the spring when they're just sitting there. Tennessee, Florida, and and uh, Michigan. They have all agreed, the athletic directors have agreed on their stationery to send out our applications for season tickets with the All-American Football League, and we're going to give them 12% of the net return on the tickets. Uh, we're going to hire the bands where possible and pay the band director and the bands to participate in the league. We've secured New Balance as a major sponsor for all of our wearing apparel. I, I think the teams will be comprised of guys, maybe a lot like me and a lot of you, that just wanted to play four or five more years of college football while they're working on their master's, their doctor's degree, their lawyer degree, whatever. And then we'll uh, incorporate them into the community, and, uh, and their salaries are going to be from $50,000 plus bonuses, uh, and then it goes up to $100,000 plus bonuses. Uh, for the uh, teams and the ca salary caps will be kept because the league will own the teams. Uh, pe players will be required to participate in community service on Mondays. And uh, when we had our combine tryouts throughout all these particular areas, we received very, very good support from the communities. In each community, we have formed advisory boards with all the community leaders to support the team. We had over 6,000 players sign up. For the tryouts, we selected 2,000, were invited for the playoffs, uh, for the tryouts, and then we're having a team draft come up. We'll draft 360 players, of which we'll select 246 for the teams, and uh, those will make the six-team rosters, plus they'll have three or four taxi club, uh, taxi squad members for the team as well. Uh, the NFL organization, the Officials Association, has contacted us and they are going to assign our officials and supervise our officials. The All-American Football League Board uh, consists of the following people and educators and leaders in the NCAA. Our chairman is Sid Dempsey, former president of the NCAA. Marcus Katz, who is our founder and is supplying all the funding for the league. Doug Dickey, former AD and football coach at Tennessee. Gene Corrigan, former commissioner at ACC. Pete Dallas, former AD at UCLA. Dr. Martin Massengale, former chancellor of Nebraska. Dr. Charles Young, former chancellor of UCLA in Florida. 
Dr. Charles Wethington, former chancellor of University of Kentucky, Gary Roberts, the dean of the University of Indiana Law School, myself, former athletic director of the United States Naval Academy. Our league president, vice president of operation is Keenan Davis, who is a former executive with NFL Europe. And in closing, I just want to say we're going to start the season in 2008. I hope that we can have your support, participation, and uh, this gives an opportunity for your football college graduates to participate in a, uh, a college-like pro team, and it's also going to provide opportunities for retired coaches to be a part of our league as well. We're going to expand the league in 2009, and uh, if you have any questions, there are some brochures that you can pick up, information, or contact any of our board members.